Hey guys, it's Marlo back again with yet another toy review, and this time it's brought to you by Funko and their five star horror line of figures. Now, I previously did a video on their Pennywise. Again, this is the five star version, and I picked it up because I'm a big fan of the It movie franchise and Pennywise, and I thought I'd be okay with just this figure, but uh, soon after I felt like he seemed a little bit alone, so I decided to pick up the other three figures in the collection and it also helped that I picked these up at Hot Topic and they had their hot cash rewards going on so uh, normally these retail for I don't know I, I don't know if the prices are still on there oh, okay you can see there um, they go for $10.90 at Hot Topic <clears throat> but because of their hot cash sales I was able to get these at basically half price so around five dollars each so Again, it made it more, you know, worth my while to pick up and collect the whole set. And now Pennywise will not be alone. So here we have Freddy Krueger. Definitely had to get him. They all come with this nice window box display. And you can see Freddy inside there with two extra hands. These are the <clears throat> hands with, uh, I believe, their syringes at the tips there. Kind of funny that they would include those. So that's pretty cool. And then let's move on to Jason Voorhees, of course from the Friday the 13th franchise. And you can see him there. He comes with his axe and machete. And last but not least, we have Chucky from the Child's Play, oops, Child's Play franchise. <clears throat> and he comes with his little voodoo doll accessory there and his knife so pretty cool and they all pretty much have identical packaging you can see the artwork there on the back of the boxes and if you haven't already please check out my review on the Pennywise five-star figure here by Funko I'll put a link in the description but let's move on and take a closer look at the other figures that I have here out of package. And here we have the figures out of package and I must say they look pretty awesome. I love these five star figures. They capture just the right amount of cuteness, sort of a Disney-esque uh, style of uh, cuteness to them with uh, you know the likenesses of these iconic horror characters. So you can see here with Freddy he has his fedora hat and you can see all the nice burnt details of his face there nicely done again a funny great combination I think of horror and uh, cuteness all in one here and like all the other five star figures so far they have three points of articulation <clears throat> here at the head and the two arms that go up and down basically so nothing at the hips or legs unfortunately but uh, again these are just nice pieces to display and since I like to customize my figures, I might go back through all these figures and, you know, repaint them a little bit, add some more detail to uh, the sculpt here. Let me see, let me push these guys back. <clears throat> Doesn't seem to be focusing very well. Okay, hopefully I can get that to focus better. There we go. So, um... I want to bring out some of the details here in the scarring and the burnt areas of the face. Maybe you throw in a little blood splatter here and there. But really nice detailing throughout. You can see the gloved hand there. Really well done. So again, a great cute <laughs> horror figure here to add to your collection. Let's move on to Jason. <clears throat> he has his iconic hockey mask. Again, maybe a little too clean for my taste. I might go back, dirty him up, add more blood splatter to the knife and maybe, you know, around his uh, legs or something a little bit, maybe even to the machete. I mean, the, uh, the ax there. But again, really nice details to the overall figure. And the eyes are nicely painted. You can see the back of the head there. So again, a great combination of cute with these uh, horror figures. 
<clears throat> and then we have the smallest figure in the bunch. Not quite to scale, but at least they tried to scale him down, which is much appreciated. This is Chucky. See the details on him. Again, nice paint apps to the eyes. They got the little details there with the freckles. So again, really well done. He comes with his dagger, and you can also see the details there on the dagger. Some voodoo type uh, writing there, and then he does come with this voodoo doll. Again, really nice little details there that they added in. And with him, I don't know how I would try to customize him. He might stay the way he is. He, you know, he's just basically a doll, so <clears throat> he can stay pretty clean. And then again, I did a review on him before. Uh, on his own, this is Pennywise. I might touch up the details in the forehead there with the wrinkles. Again, he is pretty cool. And if you saw that video, uh, you would know that mine came with the arms reversed. So since then, I was able to heat it up with a blow dryer, uh, you know, soften up the arms, pop them off, and then switch them to their corrected position. So you can see now that uh, I have switched the arms and they are in the correct spot. Again, I'll put a link in the, the uh, description to that video if you care to check that out. It was kind of funny to see the arms in the wrong position. And since we have them all now, let's see how they look side by side. They look pretty awesome. Hopefully they'll do more figures in the horror line for this 5 star collection. I would like to see a Michael Myers, for example. Maybe Ghostface from, from Scream, maybe a Pinhead, stuff like that. So just a few more, maybe another four characters would be kind of cool to uh, add on to this horror line. Uh, what other horror iconic uh, characters would you like to see in the collection? Let me know, put it in the comments below. Um, I know there's a bunch out there, so what would you think would uh, translate nicely into these five star horror figures? Let me know. So anyways, hopefully you enjoyed this quick little review and unboxing. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up, share the video, like the video. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Take care, guys. Keep on collecting. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.